this reading is for Aquarius for the month of May year 2024. Please check your moon, your rising, and your Venus. Please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Hit the like button, share, and subscribe. This is a general reading. Allah, please send Aquarius 200 angels to stand guard, guide, and protect. Allah, please send me 200 angels to stand guard, guide, and protect me as I open this portal. I do not partner you with my divine nation, but I ask of you to guide me through so that my readings are truthful, accurate, and honest. Allah, please reveal to me Aquarius's energy. You got this Knight of Cups. So there was an offer. What's the offer for Aquarius? Now, Aquarius, you can have water in your chart. Okay. So there's an offer for you. Some of you Aquariuses could be, um, you know, in church or organization, or you could be doing um, uh, civic duties. There could be a job offer elsewhere. You could be having an offer to relocate, find happiness elsewhere. You could be tired of the current restrictions. Restrictions. Be careful. Be careful because, like I said, you could have water in your chart. Or there's a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio that's involved, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Somebody looks at you as if you are right for a position. So somebody tried to sweet talk you. They were trying to cause some type of imbalances because they're in a five of cups. Don't believe this person because they're playing with you. They're playing with your emotions. You fought with this person and you reconciled with this person. You compromise with this person. Every time you have an opportunity, it's a battle. You could be dealing with the Leo, okay? You got to remain strong against this person. This person brings you karma. What goes around comes around. The past is catching up to somebody, whether it's you or someone else. There's karma here. Wow. This person doesn't want you to work, doesn't want you to shine. Three of Pentacles in reverse. This person, whoever you're dealing with, Aquarius, puts their own needs above yours. They will do nice things for you, but only it's for control because they'll start to cause arguments and fights each time you reconcile with this person. Why does this person want a strong hold on Aquarius? Confirm the King of Cups, Five of Cups, Two of Pentacles, Page of Cups, and the Knight of Wands. Queen of Cups here. Okay? You could have water in your chart. Like I said, you could be intuitive. You could be good with money. You could have been talking to someone else that is better than this person here. And they're worried. You could be highly intuitive. Like I said, you could be good with money. You could be good with management. It's like everything that this person says, it turns into an argument because someone wants control. Now, you could be dealing with the Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, heavy on the water, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Show me this Queen of Cups here for Aquarius. Loss of momentum, no energy, goals have been forgotten. Someone has to take responsibilities for their own abilities. Lack of insight. It's like someone's looking at you. This could be a friend that was helping you through the hardships with this person. And because you reconciled with whoever this is, they feel as that that cycle period is over. Okay. Like they don't even, yeah, death. 
Death to the friendship. Wow. So this person, this other person that you had a friendly connection with was actually someone that was right for you. Was a blessing. Huh. Someone that you can manifest with. What did this person do? Because Aquarius, I see that <clears throat> there's this could be a baby mother or a baby father. Okay? And every time you would try to compromise with the temperance card, every time you would try to heal, compromise, okay, here comes this person. What did this person do? to remove this good friend from Aquarius's life. They're jealous, they're spying. That person's bad luck to you. You stop talking to this, this queen of cups over there. You stop talking to them, okay? There's bad luck with this person. Could be a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius that you was dealing with, they are bad luck to you. They are bad luck. They are plagued with the bad luck. They want to bring you bad luck. So they were supposed to stop. They, they want to slow you down. You got to bring that balance out, okay? The justice is in your favor. You are protected from this person, but you cannot believe what they say. Don't believe a damn thing what they say because they're in that player energy. You, it's like... I'm being guided to tell you, Aquarius, you already seen the outcome about this person. You already know that possibly they even have a mental illness. They're not happy. Queen of Wands, ain't that something? Queen of Wands, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, they are not happy. This person betrayed you. Envy of others, repressed anger, criminal acts, cheat someone out of some money, loss of home or possessions. Huh. So they're paranoid with the moon Pisces Cancerian energy. They manifested something against you to stop talking to this person, to, to stop talking to this decent person. Show me the moon and the magician. You got the king of wands here and the knight of swords here. They come rushing in. They came rushing in. And some of you are very attractive. If you walk into a room, you know, um, you, you, you light it up. You have very good energy. You could even be dealing with the Sagittarius. Or you can have Sagittarius in your chart. This person is overindulged in your business. They try to flaunt some type of material success, but that doesn't even make them happy. They're not focusing on the true commitment. It's out of control. Like they just want to control you, restrict you with an illusion. That's what I'm saying. Don't trust what this person has to say. Wow. Move forward successfully. You can move forward successfully without this person because this person is holding you back. You know it, Queen of Swords. You know it, Aquarius. Heal. Because this person broke your heart just recently. Betrayed you. All what you invested in with this person is like this person don't get it. There's this is Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Seven of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You invested a lot with this person and nothing paid out. Nothing came. Nothing came 
the way that it was supposed to. It's like when I mean by nothing came to you as it was supposed to, this person was investing on sabotaging you the whole damn time. There's something about your light. There's something about you, okay, that this person does not like. And this is who you are. This is your what you like. This is your your connection with the highest source. This is this is something that you are supposed to be doing. God is going to lead you on some like a mission, and it has something to do with a church. It has something to do with the organization. This person does not want you to do it. So every time you get ready to step forward, this person talks some nonsense, bring you back. That person's under judgment here. They have revenge, anger, they're manipulative, and they're controlling. They have a tendency to be aggressive. They're, they're going to have money trouble or you had money trouble because of this person. Devil is in reverse. So, yeah, this is heavy. This is heavy. This is what they do. This is how they get you. This is how they push good people out of your life. Okay? And you know that. You know it. This person, I must be picking up a male or female because um, the Queen of Swords is here and the King of Swords. So this person, like I said, could be a baby mother. Okay? They're not good with money. They're, they spend... Um, with extravagance, they bring trouble to their personal relationships. They have fear when you find someone around that's better. Like God sent someone to you that is way better than this person, that it doesn't overreact, that doesn't use witchcraft, that doesn't manipulate, that's not controlling, actually enjoys conversating with you, enjoys being around you, okay? Um, this person has psychological problems, no personal growth, hunger, sickness, possible loss of possessions. Okay. So life is out of balance for this individual. They also try to project that energy onto you with gossip. Somebody needs to update their will, prepare or update their will. There will be changes in their in affairs. Okay, conflict continues to dominate this person's life. Lack of strength. They're, they they can't argue their point of views or don't want you to argue your point of views because whatever you're speaking, whatever you're revealing is the truth. So what do they do? They retaliate <clears throat> with revenge, anger, not moving forward. It's not going to be good if you get back with this person. This is the truth with the Ace of Swords. They're not doing any soul searching. They don't care how they hurt you or vice versa. You don't care how you hurt them. So take what resonates. But there's emotional upheaval, okay? This person's priorities is out of whack. They wanted your priorities to be out of whack. Vice versa, take what resonates. So someone entered a world that is not for the weak, they went down the wrong path. Or you could be feeling like you went down the wrong path dealing with this person. God is definitely sitting them down. So whoever you rejected and chose this three of cups here, it wasn't the right choice. This person, whoever you got kids by, wants full control. So all aspects of someone's life is open to disaster. Okay, financial ruin. This person actually brought you financial struggles. Okay? Mm-hmm. You, this, I told you, I told you, this person doesn't even want you to do civic duty in church. They don't want you to have a position in church. So some of you could be deacons. Some of you could be an organization. This person did not want you well suited for career. There's deception. And this deception will finally cause an end to a relationship. Friends betray you with slander and gossip. This person betrayed you with slander and gossip. Bad advice serves someone else's needs. Loss of faith, medical, professional, religious, or educational institutions. 
So this person doesn't want you to have this position in organization, church, or school. Well, they're trying to block a tower. This is why they keep dragging you back in. Okay, it's because they don't want to go through this tower by themselves. They're trying to stop a tower. They're full throttle and burdens behind their choices. Okay, so I hope that helped you. Um, keep your guard up. Keep prayed up. This person is not, and, and I see there's kids involved. This person is not going to let you go no matter what. Even if this person decides to cheat on you, Bring someone else around your kids. You can't have a life. You cannot have a life of your own. This person will stalk the hell out of you. Make sure you feel some type of way because they're using that, that devil, moon, and magician energy. What's the outcome for Aquarius? You got unexpected income here. Why is unexpected income here for Aquarius? You could have been given to this person. This person could have been given to you. Judgment. Could be child support. You could have been threatened with child support. There could be fines you have to pay. Unexpected income and adjudication. You got poverty here. Okay. <laughs> Why is... Unexpected income here, adjudication and poverty for Aquarius. Occupation, yes. Yeah, see, you might have lost a job behind this person. You might have lost a job behind this person. They want to trap you in this, this, this courtship, okay? Made you not a wealthy man. So if, as long as you don't have money, as long as you don't have enough money, you will depend on them. That's why they uh, made you lose a job. That's why there was less money in your life. It's because they want to give to you. You understand? They don't want you to have your own finances. They want you to depend on them. Yeah, well, that didn't work well because you can, this is a mature man, toes and labors, and work. So there's a message. Someone's not in the family room. Family room is in reverse. Why is family room in reverse? With message for Aquarius. Official person is in reverse. That's your baby mama I'm talking about. Well, there's a main man that's in the background still. There's a main man that's in the background. You're the official person. Okay, there's a main man that's in the background that has already been around your child. Also, there could be, uh, you could have been taking care of a child that's not yours. Coffin is here, reversal of fortune. This person will not stop. You got despair here, not hiring. What's the outcome? Courthouse. Community. This person could have placed you in jail. The community possibly thought you was going to leave this person alone. No changes. Nothing's going to change with this person. Someone's in bad health. And now they're thinking. Somebody's in bad health. Mm. Why is thoughts in bad health here? For Aquarius. False person, sudden wealth in reverse. Yeah, so there was your your baby mother was with another man. And that other man could have gave her some bad health. That was a gift. Yeah, marriage came out in reverse, and that's now a concern because you guys were supposed to get married. Yeah. 
Distant Horizon. Journey. You're going on a whole different journey. You're going the opposite direction. So this is why your, your ex is pissed. Why is marriage in reverse? The engagement is off. Oh, snap. Well, yep, there was arguing and fighting. Yep. Some people love the sound of this. A marriage is off. Engagement is off. What's the outcome for Aquarius? You're just going to be there for your child. Only one child could be yours with this person. You could have a daughter. You could have a son. But there's a little girl on the card. That's why I just said that. You're not going to give this person another chance. You're not going back in that damn tower. You rejected this offer of marriage. Too much came to light. Stop letting people who do so little for you control so much of your mind, feelings, and emotions. Eight of Swords, this person was stressing you out, was trying to trap your life, trying to trap you in lies. Now, you could have did this or someone could have did this to you, but I really see for some Aquariuses, this is what happened to you. You have a lot of self-love. You gave this person a lot of love in the relationship. That person's just angry all the damn time. Literally was competing with you. If you want me in your life, put me there. I shouldn't be fighting for a spot. They're trying to do things their own way. Okay? Some of you smoke weed. Single. No, I'm just in a relationship with freedom. And that's where I'm going to leave it. You're like, you're staying single. You're focused on your success. So I hope that helped you, Aquarius.